so today is May 9th and one of the, one of the many things I did today was to make a trellis or a little mini dragon fruit tree. I want to make a dragon fruit tree using a probably a 25 gallon pot with a wood beam circular or, or square on the top so they can climb up and hang down but since it's quarantine and, and restrictions in the stores it's hard to get materials and I don't have anything here to make anything out of that so in the meantime I decided okay I need to get these guys out of the shade because they, they've grown they've grown a little bit since coming out of the greenhouse which would be officially over a little over a month now but I want to get them outside. So today I just got done making this temporary trellis and then um, hopefully keep this here until I can get the materials to get, make a, a you know more permanent dragon fruit tree. Uh, I still wanna make it small enough to go in the greenhouse when it gets cold. So we'll take a look at all the dragon fruits. There are five plants here. This one, this is the largest piece right here. This plant right here, down there, then has these large fingers right here, the three right there. So those are looking really, really good. It's four main branches of the plant. And then there's one more back here, on the back side. There we go. Nice big sections like here. And I think this one grew a lot while it was outside miraculously so as you can see there's the five pots what i'm also going to do is wrap all of these guys in a plastic bag um just to trap the moisture here because i don't know if yeah it's close to the water but i don't know how often these will get watered and this is a temporary dragon fruit trellis until i can get materials to make a dragon fruit trellis and then also when it's safe enough to go outside or you know go to go to stores so this is the temporary dragon fruit trellis yeah, can we see how much they grow in, in a short amount of time? But you know, these guys are better where they are right now than where they were before. So I can't wait to see.